hi. Um, I'm at the end of this video. I've already made the whole thing, and I know how this plays out. It didn't go exactly how I was hoping. I just want all of you to watch this video with the mindset of, um, it's all for fun. You know, we're all here just to watch some content. The only reason I'm really making this is because I had nothing else to do during this situation where I'm stuck at home and I wanted to give you guys something to watch and I wanted to give you one of the most requested videos that this channel gets, which is me retrying Xenoblade 2, a game that I already said I don't really like. So, however this video goes, just remember I made it for you guys and I'm sorry. <laughs> Is anybody else losing their freaking mind? <laughs> Look, I am desperate. I am at the end of my freaking rope over here. I know it looks like I have a lot of games up there, but I've played most of the ones I want to play, and the other ones I bought just to hoard them. I'm running out of games! <laughs> and you might be asking, well, why don't I just play Animal Crossing? Well, apparently I have to wait for my house, for my shop, and for my museum to be built tomorrow. I guess I'm gonna give... An old game, another chance, another chance to shine and possibly uh, correct the wrongdoings of the past. If there were any wrongdoings, that's what we're going to find out right now. <laughs> God, <coughs> oh, I got hair in my mouth. So what game am I revisiting? What game am I giving a second chance today? Where, what is my most hated Nintendo Switch game? If you've been watching the channel for a while, you'll already know where this is going. <laughs> No. Go! <laughs> Alright guys, I know this is super off topic and I'm sorry to interrupt the video already, but I keep trying to play that new Half-Life Alex game and every time I start it, this weird ad pops up. Is this a new thing in VR? Yeah, I'll show you what I mean. Hi, my name's Wood. You might know me from that YouTube show, Beat em Ups. And do you know what I have in common with people like Cardi B, Justin Bieber, Drake? Well, I mean, yeah, so, so many, many things, things, of course, but mostly, we all love Raycons. Oh. I adore my Raycons because, well, the sound quality is incredible, but also, they start at about half the price of any other premium wireless earbud on the market. Their newest model, the Everyday E25s, are easily their best ones. Yes. Yeah. With six hours of playtime, seamless Bluetooth pairing, more bass, and a more compact design to give an even better noise isolating fit. They also come in a wide variety of colors, just like the blue ones I downloaded into your headset just now. Ah! What? Oh! How did he do that? I didn't even pay for him. No need to thank me. Just make sure everyone watching this at home clicks that link in their description to get 15%, that's right, off their order. This has been another VR advertisement brought to you by Raycons. We hope you now enjoy your game. Okay, well, you see what I mean? I'm just trying to play the game and that happens every time. Well, at least the ad's over. Hi, I'm Wood from Beat'em Ups, and this is Doglet, the first dog chocolate for humans. Mmm, that's what's up, dog. Ah, oh, come on! If you don't get what is happening right now, uh, you might be new around here. I made a, uh, a review on Xenoblade Chronicles 2 when the game released. I wanted, I want to throw out there that um, when the Switch kind of came about and, and my channel started blowing up, I was very fresh-faced on YouTube still, didn't really have a footing, and I, and I definitely hadn't really dived into structured video game reviews before, and, and Xenoblade Chronicles 2 was one of my earliest reviews, and it was... Bad. I feel bad for the people that are watching this right now, but I still don't like the game and I've never had any real reason to go back and play it until now. Everyone has always wanted me to play it again. All the fans of this game have always begged me to give it one more chance. So here we go. Okay, Xenoblade, wow me. Give me everything you've got. I want to see the light. I want to be reawakened as a Xenoblade Chronicles 2 fan. I'm not going to say as a Xenoblade fan, because there's been Xenoblade games that I actually like. Like the first Xenoblade Chronicles. And I even liked the Xenoblade that was on Wii U. This truly was the first one I didn't like. But I would still like to be reawoken as a Xenoblade Chronicles 2 fan. So let's see how this goes. Do you want to come play Xenoblade with me? No. Yeah, no one does. It's fine. No! Oh! 
Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. <laughs> I don't know if you guys heard that. <laughs> oh, that's right. I really can't remember. So Rex, Rax, what was his name? Something like that. He was a deep sea diver or something. That's why he had that big weird suit thing that he has. That's why he looks so dumb. Time to earn your lunch. To initiate combat, the first thing Rex needs to do is draw his weapon. To draw your weapon, simply press A while targeting the enemy. Uh, okay. So okay. draw my weapon. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm feeling stronger than before. So that was uh, the first enemy. I wouldn't mind actually diving into the game the more critically than I did. Because it really my first review was just game bad. Don't like. Watch this. Ugh. That was it. <laughs> this is a mukbang. All right, finally. Looks like your adventure about to really get going. And you can count on me to offer timely explanations of uh, any new game features you may encounter. And from what I remember, <laughs> you don't shut up. Now, I do, I do, I do remember really liking this game visually. I know on the monitor and the, and the TV it was a little grainy, but in handheld mode it looked great. Especially when you get to the open world area. That place. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, I forgot about those really annoying little furballs. Is this our first interaction with one of these things? Oh gosh. If you haven't played this game before, I'm sorry for what it, what's about to happen. So weaponry is hot item. Well, what friend think I'll make it worth your while? You guys Catch remember that Don't episode touch. of The Office when Kevin decides it's to use less friend. words hey, to hey. save time. Well, so me think, why waste time? Say lot word when few word do trick. These little puffball characters are literally Kevin in that episode, except for the entire game, and you can't make them talk normally. It's so annoying. It's bad, me think. Not to mention the voice, the English voice acting in this game. I, pro I, I forgot to switch it to Japanese. In fact, let's go ahead and do it now, because it is... Awful. It is like the worst voice acting in a Nintendo game. I swear. I it's I and I don't I, that that one I'm completely unapologetic about. You can defend any part of this game and give me a reasonable argument, and I'll probably at least see the reasoning. But if you try and defend the voice acting in this game, or even those <clears throat> Kevin Puffballs, sorry, you're wrong. You're just wrong. It is okay to be wrong, but you're wrong. I was. 53 hours into that playthrough? I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. It's been three years. It's been three years. I didn't even realize how much of this game I played. All this time. I, you know how sick. Oh, this is like heaven for me. This is everything to me right now. You know how often I get comments about that video. And granted that video was bad. It sucked, and I'll admit that. But do you know how often I get comments on other videos? Not even that video of people saying, I can't take this guy seriously. He played a game for 10 hours and said it sucked. No. Not exactly what happened. I'll have you know that at the point of me making that awful video, I'd played the game for 15 hours. I remember that. I remember that very well. Because after playing 15 hours, that's how long it takes to finish most games. It still sucked. But I then went on to play Xenoblade Chronicles 2 for 53 hours, 21 minutes, and 37 seconds. And do you know how much fun I had in that time? Hit you with a big old fastball zero. I gave the game 53 hours worth of a chance. And you know what? I don't even care about that playthrough. So we're gonna save over it with 13 minutes. No, uh, let me reiterate. The reason why that was therapeutic for me was because I get those comments all the time of people saying his opinion doesn't count because he only played the game. No, I played the game for 53 hours. Oh, I forgot. Job, maybe. The whole reason I saved it. I went on my little tangent and then forgot what I was doing. I gotta, let the, I gotta fix the voice acting. Because, <laughs> oh. Thank you, gosh. It's like heaven to my ears, and I haven't even heard anything yet. <coughs> let's see let's see if this fixes the game for me. It's like a whole new game! A whole new game!
They're probably still talking like idiots, but I can't understand it, so I don't care. I mean, I can read what they're saying, but it's 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 hearing it that drills a freaking bore into my brain. No, you don't need to explain everything in the game. I understand how the camera works. <laughs> Even he's better. He's got so much sass now. I just want to point out though, this marker right now, it's like above my head, right? So you would think that like somewhere over there by that window, but no, it's actually, I'm supposed to go all the way to the left. So you would think the marker would be all the way to the left. It's just, it's just weirdly off. Like, see, that's right in front of me. So you would think, oh, I'll just go straight. But then it slowly drifts to the left. But now you would think that it should be all the way to the left. But no, it's not. In fact, I can walk past it, and it's still barely all the way to the left. It's a stupid marker. What do I like about the game so far? Maybe we should, uh, <laughs> talk about that. The story is, is pretty epic. Like, I do like the scope of the story. Um, I like the feeling of I'm just playing as this diver kid guy who's kind of already, without realizing, getting, like, in over his head, accepts this job for, like, you know, 200,000 gold, which is a lot of money for him. He gets 100,000 up front, and then kind of everything goes, um, everything kind of just goes wrong after this, and he finds himself in this big, crazy adventure, making a lot of friends, and then he finds out that he's some, like, guy destined for bigger, greater things. <laughs> oh, I didn't want to do this. I'll be right back. So I didn't do this just because- Oh, I won. Good. I didn't buy these just because it's the Apocalypse and Twinkies. You know the movie. But I saw a Strawberry Twinkies and I figured I could just do like a live in the video taste test of Strawberry Twinkies. I do like Twinkies. They're so greasy. <laughs> what do they do to Twinkies to make them so greasy? I can't remember what the point of this diving deck is. Oh, never mind. It'll tell me. Now, I think this is like time but Yeah, okay. Did I hit that? Oh, no. I must have missed it. Well, I got two out of three. I think the better you time it, the more stuff you get. Hey, so much treasure! Look at me go. I'm rich. That's like more money than I got from accepting the freaking job. Oh, the other thing I really liked is the music. As I sit here listening to it, waiting for this tutorial part to be over. The music in this game is beautiful. Spoilers. I know that we set off, we crash, then the game starts. I don't remember how long that takes. I don't remember it being too long. I can level up. Oh yeah! Every time you go to bed, you level up. I, I do remember liking that. So many freaking tutorials! Oh no! Oh, oh, oh. I didn't know there was full damage. Oh, I forgot about those. Those are my favorite characters. Yeah, yeah, look who's here. The whole party is getting together. I mean, those guys totally won't betray us later. Oh, oh, what happened to your face? Someone didn't finish rendering it. Yeah, maybe leave your helmet on. Was his helmet maybe not supposed to be off in that scene? Was was that like an accident? Because his face didn't look finished. I'm ready! Take me away to the better part of the game. I think everyone signing on to play Animal Crossing is making me jealous. Yeah, look at this guy. That guy's totally gonna betray me. He just looks like a bad guy. And his name's Malos. Like, that's such an evil guy name. Oh, what is that following us? There's no way this will end badly. Soybean oil. Has to be the soybean oil that makes it so greasy. How are there so many ingredients in a Twinkie? It's a big bug! Burn it with fire! Or kill it with auto attacks is what's probably gonna happen. We did it! We killed the bug! It was a tough slug, but we got there in the end. Battle has been initiated. Kill him, Rex! Do my bidding! Nah, I believe in you. You can beat him. You can take down that bubble guy. I can use an ability now! Money, 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 money. Oh, 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 it's a big bug. Now you can, by all means, comment section below if I am playing wrong. 
because I would really love to know what it is that I do wrong in this game. Because I know there has to be something more to the combat than what I'm doing. And I know to like, to some extent, I'm having a little bit of a goof and a gaff with it. But I really, I, I really want to know what it is that I can do to flesh this out some more. Because it's just, how I play, I guess I just play like this. Oh my god, I'm so bored. <laughs> You see that giant crab coming out? That's gonna- Hey, somebody heal me. I'm real close to dying. Oh, over here. Well, that's not where the waypoint was pointing at all. It's literally behind me. And what's behind door number one? A big toad bug fish thing. Oh, shark fish bug thing. No. <laughs> no. Oh, I did a lot of damage, actually. <laughs> I'm already dead. He two hit me. What the heck? <laughs> All right, let's try that again. What the heck? I don't remember dying of that last time. What is happening? Where'd this difficulty curve come from? <laughs> I can't even get into the fight. Maybe I forgot to equip items. Yeah, I didn't put on this stuff. That's why the game's been so hard so far. <laughs> Maximum HP by 24%. I'm, I'm... Idiot! I'm dumb! This time, we got it! I got you, big shark bug thing! What happened? What happened? I've got you this time! You're all mine! What? How has this game all of a sudden gone from me not needing to use the controller to me not being able to initiate the fight without dying? What is going on with this game? It's so so mental it makes no sense i don't remember i don't remember losing to this the first time around i think i rushed out of that first area maybe i was supposed to do more quest first i don't know i've done something wrong clearly because i can't beat this freaking thing and i couldn't even move then i was like locked in that animation why are you so slow why are you so slow all right you know what fine i'm not the only one here i won't even battle it i'll stand Oh, that's so annoying. He's nowhere near me. This game makes no sense. You guys got this. I believe in you. I was the one dying and, and costing us all the game. So I'm just going to stay out of their way. I'm just, I, I need a break. <laughs> I can't do this anymore. I'm really trying. I'm really freaking trying to like this game. I know it seems like I'm not trying, but I promise I am. I'm trying. You guys wanted this. Can I remind you all, please? This is probably one of like my top five most requested videos on my entire freaking channel is to give Xenoblade another chance. Like everyone wanted me to do this. Was it worth it? Did <laughs> Because I feel like I've just made it worse. I'm done. I'm done. Whatever. I'm done. I don't know. I don't I don't, I don't. <laughs> just Look, I don't like it. And I don't think I'm ever going to like it. And that's okay. Sometimes you just don't like certain games. This game just ain't for me. That's okay. So can we all please stop asking me to give this game another chance? Can we just let it die? It's a fantastic game. I've always said that it's a great game that a lot of people love. It's just not going to be for everyone. And I'm just in that category of it's not for everyone. So I'm, I'm going to go back to Animal Crossing now and see if my house is ready. And I'm going to play that. <laughs> I hope that this video was fun for you. I hope it was good for you. <laughs> and killed some time um during this situation all right i love you all bye i'm just gonna go before i make this worse bye <laughs> what do you think xenoblade yay or nay no boy your eyeballs pulsed out your f nah, nah, that's my thoughts exactly <laughs>